Hello everyone, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make announcement bar bigger on Shopify or how to change the size of the announcement bar on Shopify. For example, this is my announcement bar at the moment. I'll be showing you how to increase or decrease the size without using any apps or so on. The first thing you will need to do is go into your Shopify admin page. Once on the admin page, I want you to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap on online store right here. Once you have selected online store, you will automatically be redirected to the themes page. And once you're on the themes page, all you'll need to do now, right beside customize, you are going to tap on the three dots. Then you are going to select edit code. After you have selected edit code, you are going to go over to the left hand menu option and I want you to scroll down until you see assets, you are going to tap on assets. Depending on the theme that you are using, you are either going to select base.css or you are going to scroll down and if you see theme.css, you are going to select that. But I am using the dawn theme for this example and it does not have theme.css so base.css will work just fine you are going to select that then you are going to scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page once at the bottom of the page you are going to select the last blank line as you can see right here then what I want you to do next you are going to simply paste the code that I'm going to be leaving in the description so we are going to copy the code then we are going to paste the code right here. Once you have pasted the code, all you'll need to do now, you are going to tap on save. Once it has been saved, you can tap on preview store in the top right hand corner. Or if I were to refresh this page, you can see the current size right there. Let's say I were to refresh the page, you can see that it is now smaller. And if you would like to change the size again, we'll simply go back into the code. And by the way, right where you see font size 10px, that's the second to last line right here. This is the size that it will be on a mobile device or a smaller screen device. For larger devices, for example, like a desktop or a laptop or for example, a tablet, this will be the font size, which is 12px. So let's say I would like to change it to, for example, 28px. I'll simply type in 28 right there. Then I'll tap on save once more in the top right hand corner. Then once it has been saved, if I were to go back to my store, you can see the current size right there. If I were to refresh the page, you can see that it is a lot larger now, as you can see right there. And again, if you would like to change the size also on a mobile device, you can simply increase the font size or decrease the font size right there. And if you would like it to be even larger or smaller, let's say I would like to carry it up to 32 just for example sake, then tap on save once more. And if I were to go back onto the preview page, then refresh the page, you can see that it is even larger now. And if you would like to also know how to change the text size, I mean the text color or so on, there are also videos how to do that on my channel. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.